Negotiations between U.S. Democratic President Joe Biden and Republican senators over an infrastructure package are inching forward, even though disagreements remain. Republican Senator Shelley Moore Capito told Fox News Sunday, quote, I think we can get to real compromise, absolutely, because we're both still in the game. Capito leads a group of six Republicans who have been in regular contact with the White House. Her side last week proposed $928 billion to improve roads, bridges, and other traditional infrastructure projects. Much of the funding would come from reallocating money meant for other programs. The Biden administration's latest offer in negotiations is for $1.7 trillion and would include projects such as home care for the elderly. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg described negotiations to ABC's This Week, saying, quote, There's movement in the right direction, but a lot of concerns. One of the many sticking points, the White House wants to offset the cost of the plan with new taxes on the wealthy and on corporations. When asked about rolling back some of the tax cuts enacted during the Trump administration, Capito said, quote, I'm not going to vote to overturn those. She also held the line against funding for projects that go beyond physical infrastructure. The talks were expected to continue this week, even though Congress is on a break, with the Senate returning on June 